many of us have dreamt about running off and joining the circus? <laughs> For a special group of kids here in Denver, that dream has become a reality. Denver 7's Sean Toll shows us how they are learning the tricks under the big top. Moth Performing Circus is prepping for their shows of the Nutcracker this winter. Do you want to do it again or do you want to spin? But on this occasion, you want to do it again. They're filled with a special group of performers. The kids are here through our connection to Adams Camp, um, and it's an organization um, that helps kids that are atypical. And we like to bring them in and we'll teach them about being in the circus. Do you want to sit on it like a swing? Atypical kids learning circus tricks is far from typical. What a special experience it is. The confidence building is huge. Ready, try again. Among those kids, yes! seven-year-old Valen. She loves it. She met circus director Dina Markham Selko a couple years ago at one of their shows. I love Miss Dina and everything. Love Miss Dina. And they've developed quite the bond. She comes here a lot, as much as she can. They live pretty far away, Estes Park. So they, they travel all the way here just to come and hang out with me, <laughs> basically. It's worth it to drive that far and to have the experience for her. And when she comes, she gives me the biggest hugs. It's a bond they only hope grows. They're doing so great! Awesome. Awesome. Whether flying or bouncing, seeing Valen and the kids like her take flight through the circus. It is probably more rewarding than any other work. <laughs> Sean Toll. Thank you. You're welcome. Denver 7. What a great story. All right, a quarter of the proceeds from all the Moth Circus show benefit Adams Camp for Kids with Special Needs, and they will be performing the Nutcracker at DU in December.